Welcome back, everybody. I'm IGP, and today we're going to continue with some pollen. Now, last episode, we listened to a few tapes uh, talking about how everyone feels homesick, and not just like, I'm sad, send me home kind of thing. It's like an actual diagnosis. We're here in the med bay, and uh, we listened to the guy talk about how everyone's being diagnosed with homesickness, how everyone has low dopamine levels, and everyone is suffering from the same thing, and they all, and they concluded that it's coming from contact with the entity. The people who were most close to it felt the worst. It's very strange. And they also talked about how the bees with the pollen that's coming off of them or the weird particles that are coming off. Each individual particle is its own being. It's a very strange thing. Uh, I have no idea what's going on. Some of you guys are throwing some theories together. My favorite theory from the last episode was by Hunter Kennedy said, Fan idea. Based on the recordings at the end, the entity is manipulating the people with homesickness for its own gain. It seems to make them homesick so they will return to Earth. Maybe it has infected them or latched onto them so it can spread to Earth like a disease. Or pollen, and we are the bees. That's actually kind of interesting, but I think I recall a few uh, articles talking about how Earth is uninhabitable at, this, at the moment. I guess that could be prior. Like, th like this actually, or the inhabitability of Earth could be coming afterwards and that could be the cause so that's actually a really good theory it's, you guys are posing some really creative shit uh my next favorite one was from first green dinosaur that says my theory is that everyone turned into a bee it's really smart anyway if you guys have any more ideas what's going on or you want to post your own theory do so i'll be happy to read my favorite one in the next episode if there is a next episode i have no idea how long this game is but it's fun reading what you guys think. Anyway, so we searched most of this. I don't know where it actually saved that. I think right here is fine. Now, you guys told me to use the key I got, the blue key, uh, on the locker. And I don't even know if I can. I don't think this can be unlocked. Doesn't look like it. All right, so we're moving on. We searched everything else in here, so we're fine. Um, let's go ahead and take a look out here. Whoa, forgot how scared that is. Oh, yeah, there's another portal. So I want to explore this just a little bit before we go in there. I don't know what half this stuff does. Oh, Right. Okay. That's where the keys go. Now we just need the red key. Doesn't do anything. Makes sense. So that's the big door. Uh, I would go up there, but it doesn't look like there would be anything. Oh, there might be stuff up here, actually. That's a good thing to... Let's see if we can find some stuff. Maybe there's a key up here. How convenient would that be? Where would it be, though, specifically? Now, I wonder if we're dealing... Can I... I can knock you over, right? Okay. Oh, and also, I got a little tape uh, that was different than the others, and you guys said it's probably uh, for that projector thing in the other rooms, which makes sense. Um, I wish I could kick this off. Maybe there's something behind it, like a secret. I can't get off. Jump. Oh, oh, I hurt myself. I hurt myself. I'm fine, I think. Okay, there's an elevator. Let's go up here real quick. Explore a little bit before we go into the dead world, or the other dimension, whatever, whatever we're talking about here. Ooh, that looks like somewhere I don't want to go right now. Looks like progress. All right, let's see what we got. Search for extraterrestrial life. Okay. Did we not already... Whoa. Whoops. Did we not already do that? Entity effect on plant growth. Pre preliminary, excuse me, observations of the Titan's entities... Of the Titan entities' direct and indirect effects on the growth and well-being of plants. Okay, so it's affecting everything. I'm assuming the bees, too. Spectral analysis. Monthly report. Lab supply check. Okay. Weather station maintenance. Karen's post-mortem. Whoa. Okay. Uh, Car Karen's post-mortem. Wait a second. Am I- am I misunderstanding what post-mortem means? Or do they actually know that Karen's dead? I don't understand. She was left alone, but ha we- I guess we got to her afterwards? I don't know. There was so much stuff thrown at me. I might be missing some information. You guys are probably able to piece it together a little bit better than I can because you can rewind and all kinds of stuff. Okay, computers are the future. Applied computer sciences. Uh, let's read it. You will learn programming in all four computer languages, building relationship databases, assembling whole computers from components. Okay, so we we're able to... That's advanced. Oh, here we go. Transmit what? Okay, can't press any buttons. That helps. Turn the volume down a little bit. Weird, you can still kind of hear it. Okay, it sounds like something's there. I really don't want to hear anymore. That's freaky as hell. All the stuff that's happened in this game is scaring the hell out of me. I'm not a big fan of it. Hello? What is that? What do you do? Oh, I guess it controls the, uh... Oh, the beam. Once it's in there, I guess? 
Oh, okay, I see. What the hell will we need that for? What are you? Anti-gravity ray. Oh, shit. Mandatory reading for people working in facilities equipped with Rama Industries anti-gravity ray. Uh, this provides definitive instructions and regulations for the following cases. Informing bystanders about activity, aiming and launching... Okay, that sounds really scary. I don't want to be messing with that shit. Hello. What does this stuff do? I'm just switching it on right now. Hopefully it doesn't change anything about the game. Uh, is that a cat box? Okay, let's get in here. Oh, this looks like progress. Oh no, we've unlocked it! Sweet! Easy access back. So we have that projector thing. I'll bring that back in a little bit, but I want to explore um, here. I'll try not to forget to do that. <laughs> I know that's important. Uh, ooh, wait. There's a way to close it. Let's see. Sinks. Oh, it's just a bathroom. Okay, anything important in here? Oh, hello. Games. Uh, arcade board homebrew. Peek in the future, what will be gaming look like in the year 2000? <laughs> I wonder what it will look like. Country Nintendo reseller. Okay. Cool. Bertle B. Oh, there's that B guy. Uh, Bertle B's Honey Hunt. Fun of the whole family out now. Game of the year 1993. That doesn't mean that it is 93, though. So, what is that other thing? Special offer. Collect all 10. Oh, that's probably an actual collecting part of the game. <laughs> I should have picked that one up. I wonder if I can even pocket that anyway. I'm pretty sure I picked it up and looked at it. It probably won't let me do it. Okay, so what do we got up here? Oh, what is this? Decompression chamber, hydrogen peroxide decontaminant. Yeah, I figured so. Uh, this door is unlocked. Let's open this up. Okay, so we got a few rolls of coil that I don't know what is for. Medical stuff, compact battery units. Hello. Hello. <laughs> You're crazy if you think I'm going in there. Goodbye. I'm gonna go over here first. It's locked. Ooh, Ooh I'm clean now. Now, I don't know if there's any hostile enemies or anything in here, but this is very much locked. Okay, so this is the only place I can go to. Control room, please. Please have a light switch somewhere. Fuck you. Fuck all this. Please have a light switch somewhere. Why is there no light switch? Are you for real right now? Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna throw this back there. What is it? Oh, it's glass. It's just a control room, right? I sh I knew that. I read I read the sign. Is there something moving over here? Uh, so much stuff. What? I don't. I'm assuming these buttons don't work. I'm not gonna sit here and press all that. Hello. Okay, it's Amy P, or Amanda Pohl, uh, Titan Base M. I regret to inform you that our employee, Karen Kowalski, is missing. Okay, her clothes were found near the research and along with her belongings. This happened the 18th of January. You have searched for her throughout the base. Although she suffered from homesickness, no one in the base, including CMO Dr. Roman Cech, would describe her as suicidal, self-destructive. This expected... This unexpected and sad event affects us all in our work. We will continue to put our effort... Okay, so she was stuck in the other world, more than likely. I'm gonna go ahead and assume that. That she was. Proceed with your research. The... To hear about Karen. We will notify her family immediately. Expect to receive new personnel in two weeks. Okay, so we're just ex accepting her missingness. And, uh, rolling with it. Okay. What am I transmitting? Let me transmit something. Okay. Light switch, please. Ugh. I needed you to work. Oh, is this the base? Why does that look like a hive? Why does everything look like a hive? <laughs> Anyone else notice that? Okay, so this looks like the area I need to get to. That's where the crushed dead body is. I don't feel a sense of... of enemies, but, uh, I'll tell you what, I'm still scared. Okay, so... Magnetized draw. Oh, let's turn this on. Huh? Nothing? Okay. It doesn't do anything? It looks like it's doing something. I can't tell. Where's the power? How do I turn- how do I get the power to work in here? I'm guessing I have to move something in here though because the key- the next key, the red key, is gonna open the door to in here. Right there. But I guess- I guess I'll do that and I guess I gotta go find that first. I'm not even sure. Let's go find the red key. Oh wait. Oh, I thought that was it. I was like, really? A weird place to put that. What haven't- how, what have not I explored yet? Oh, I haven't explored the next dimension. That's what I'm doing. Duh. 
totally forgot I have to do that. Oh, hello. All right, so we're going to pick up that card or th whatever and go to the other world. And hopefully, uh, hopefully we don't die. Nope. Okay. Well, strangely enough, I can't do anything with this. It, oh, is it the pack of cigarettes? Can't be. No? Okay, well, I guess I can't get into here. What I probably need to do is go back up here and go into the Roman checks place if I haven't already been there before. I don't, I don't think I have. Whoa, okay, so we can go ahead and put that thing in too. Where's the room? Is it down here? Yeah, we're gonna put that slide in and look at it. Let's look at number five. Oh, huh, pretty. It changes the whole thing around. There's a lot of information in the newspapers over here too, but I'm not sure that I want to read that right now. It's a lot of information. Oh. Did that just come out of nowhere? That's a different one, isn't is it not? No, it's the same one. Oh no, it is a different one. It just dropped out of nowhere. <laughs> oh my god, that's really annoying. Get out of here. Well, I got two out of ten is an achievement, apparently. Okay, so Roman check. That's Amanda Pohl. Karen Kowalski. Ooh, this I left this card in here. I didn't mean to. Oops. No. Get that get that back. I've already been in there. I'm gonna keep all the cards. This might be Roman check. Yeah. Okay. So we have not been in here yet. Okay, cool. We got a plant growing. Let's check his storage. How's you doing? We got pictures of cats. Uh, small pleasures. Oh, didn't mean to throw it. Let's rotate it around. Nothing. Uh, Europa. Whoa. Creepy. Okay, so we got some stuff in here. What are you? Passport? I can't take that. All right, cool. Shower looks fine. Actually, let's go in here. Just to make sure there's nothing. Ha ha! The Cold War. What do you have to say? After the assassinations of the last peaceful leaders of the Soviet Union USA, the world has drifted into a high alert state of global tension. Even the smallest mistakes could launch the final thermonuclear war where there are no winners. This horrifying thriller examines the idea of a theoretical cold war and what happens behind the scenes. As if... Oh, that's funny. That eh, makes sense now. Okay. Open that up. Whoa. Alright, so we have... Nothing we can actually mess with. Excuse, what is this? Oh. Or was it this book? Oh, The Drawer. Or The Drawer. The Drawer is an allegorical story of an artist on the verge of being replaced by modern technology. With superb accuracy, it examines the psychology of ISMS. Isms. I don't know. Technology, refugeeism, and the world as we know it. Cute. What is that? <gasps> Who's dead? Healing the self through art therapy. Art therapy has been found efficient for victims of disasters, post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD, normalizing feelings, modeling coping skills, and promoting relaxation skills. In the psychoanalytic tradition, the therapist inter interprets sorry, the subject's symbolic self-expression as communicated through art and elicits interpretations from the subject. This self-help book functions as your therapist as you analyze the meaning of your art and the mental blocks which it represents. Official communications form, sender, receivers, Rama research, okay. Due to my recent findings, I request, demand, <laughs> immediate termination of the research and time. Ba Rumors are suffering from a different hormonal disorder and structural changes of their brains. Structural changes? Positive that the loss of Karen Kowalski was caused by the entity. Immediate sealing of the base. Holy shit. Yeah, what, what date did that say? 95. Okay. 95. Uh, all requests regarding the core functions of the base or other activities must follow official procedure. We do not recognize requests from any personnel other than the base leader, Amanda Pohl. Please contact her for official information. You seem pretty confident in your request, Put, or, but Rama pays our salary, so I have to follow their orders, Amy. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, cigarette butts in that nice little tree. That sucks. Uh, panspermia? And the comet that brought us life. A radical new theory that life originated outside our solar system and the consequences that holds. That would be interesting read. Empty graph? Oh, no, it's not an empty graph. I can't rotate around properly. There we are. Uh, that's symbolic. Okay, what, what is this, though? Uh, distillery premium vodka. Very nice. You got vodka in here? Damn it. I feel like there would have been a red key in here. This doesn't really give me all that much information. What am I supposed to do about that thing? I don't know. I don't even know. Okay, back at the med bay here. 
the we got the blue key from that room. Uh, and then there was this. I don't understand. Oh wait, what's that down there? Hello. Can I get you? Can I not grab you? What are you? What exactly are you? You crushed something. I definitely feel like that there's this thing down here. I could potentially get out. That looks like someone's foot. Does that not look like someone's leg that's been severed? Oh my god, are you kidding me? I'm an idiot. I'm so dumb. I get it. I get it. We're gonna give anti-gravity to that freaking fridge or storage cube and that will all right let's just raise it up a little bit right there we go ah i'm so smart god i'm so smart hurt hurt myself didn't mean to get up all right so don't get hit by the beam now we're gonna pick up the dead leg that i'm pretty sure i knew was gonna be the thing all right cool Right? No? Whoa, it's a prosthetic leg. Okay, so this is... This is just crazy. Okay, here we go. Progress has been made very slowly. Tell you what, I don't like... It. What is this? Is this the entity? Whoa! What? What? Why does it look like that? Is that- that's very strange. Okay. You by chance have the key. No. Okay. Uh, I'm scared. I'm terrified. Well, I guess I'll go up eventually, but let's look at some of this stuff. What do we got here? Who is that? 95. I don't know who that is. Book? PI decimals. Okay. Or pi decimal, sorry. That's a glass table. Before everything was broken, or after. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Whoa. Dude, not cool. Holy shit. Uh, why is it sitting up? That's an empty suit, right? Okay. Hello. Okay. Who might you be? I didn't even look at the back of it. Shit. Where did I drop it? There it is. What does it say in the back? Nothing. Okay. We got a tape. Let's listen to it. Okay. Yes, Patrick. It's clear where I need to go to end this. I need to face the entity. I could also climb out through the air vents if I wanted. But to where? To the darkness I saw out there a week ago? Patrick, my love. I know how this will need to end. I have to go down there and face that thing. The door has been open all this time. All I need to do is step through it. Mm. I've been here, what? A year already? Of course I'm sick. I'm sick of everything. I'm sick of the realm of bars. I'm sick of the realm of beer. I'm sick of being alone. Oh, Patrick. I so miss Ethan and Jess. I miss the people I was here with. Even I and any stupid camera. I see the full couple, their cats, and I miss life, Patrick. I just want to go home. <laughs> oh my God. Why would I be recording this? Yeah. Okay, so I figured it out. She set him uh, this up, uh, the suit upright, and put Patrick's face to it. And, uh, is pretending to have someone to talk to. I guess after a year here, that would make anyone go insane. But, uh, damn. Okay, so more of the Roman check. Oh, no, that's Ian. Or Ian. Uh, several bee stings, cortisol. Oh, this cabinet is now open. There must have been something in there. Here is Roman check. Okay, uh, stomach ache, detox, sleep problems, melatonin. 
That's your go-to. That's for him. Holy shit, I have the sh I am scared right now. Uh, okay. Eyesight test. No biggie. Uh, second knee ligament sprain. Pregnancy test negative. Yeah, this is what we found in the other room. It's just, they're just scattered. Uh, what are you? Human body hormonal system. Carpets and manual of hormones in the human body. Effects on everyday life. Building elements. Okay. Uh, so this is pretty much all the same as I've seen before. I can open this up. What are you? A chart of something? Uh, Karen Kowalski. Fractured finger cast SD blood test negative. The second sex. When raised and educated, uh, exactly like men would work under the same conditions and for the same salaries, that which is now natural for human society or modern society was not for some reason. Really, uh, okay. I'm. Uh, is there something in here? Am I supposed to be looking at something specific? Because I don't want to. I don't want to be here anymore. Uh, dude, I feel like he's just following me. Give me that back. Give me that back. You can go on somewhere. Okay, so the entity is super creepy. There's some bees flying above there. That's to return. Where else is there? To go up? Okay, we're gonna go up for a little bit. I honestly have no idea how long this episode's gonna be, but I feel like I need to make a little bit more progress than before. Um, those bees are really strange. I could actually go up to them if I wanted to. Okay, so that door's open. No door open over here. Same stuff, I feel. Wait, I think I can pick that up. What are you, marker? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yep, mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Maintenance. What the hell did you draw? Some kind of fourth dimension object? I wonder if that's where this is going, too. Like, fourth dimension stuff. So the main power, can I turn that on? There we go. So there's another beam. Right now, I don't think I need it. Anti-gravity. Oh, wait a second. I'm gonna go in this room real quick, and then I'm gonna shine that down straight onto the entity. And see what happens. Oh. Great. Whoa! Excuse me. It's part of the void again. What the hell? Okay, so I can't go over here. So I'm assuming I have to do what I just said I have to do. There's that thing again, there's an- everything is still here. everything that was here before is still here. Strangely enough, I don't like the sound of that. I'm just gonna go ahead and get stuck and leave. <laughs> Alright, let's leave. Freaking me out. Let's point this thing down at the entity and see what happens. Cause... I'm ready to fuck shit up. Oh, whoa! Rama, 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 rama. Alright, so let's... Point it down. Straight onto the entity. Boom. It doesn't do anything. Uh, let's focus the beam, I guess? I don't know what that does. Alright, so what does this do? It looks like it's collecting stuff. I don't know what this stuff does. Oh, hello. Uh, it's not a toy. Yeah. Oh, I'm very much aware of that. Alright, so let's go near- Ah, oh, damn it, I keep hurting myself. So that's all I can explore, I think. But now it looks solid. Rather than being like this liquid state it was in before. Oh no, it's doing the same thing. Very strange. Okay. Oh, there's a tape. Was not aware. It is day five or six hundred. Maybe even a year. Who knows? Maybe the entity is trying to Whoa, what? Taking 
Jesus Christ. I'm going down there. I'm going to confront the cause of this all. Is she speaking metaphorically? Like figuratively? Is she speaking figuratively? I don't know what she's trying to do. Also, I don't think this beam is working. <laughs> I'd say that I don't think the beam is working. Oh, what's in here? Storage. Okay. Alright, so what I'm confused about is if she's not dying of hunger, does that mean I won't die if I hit myself with this beam? Okay, so obviously they wouldn't allow me to do that if it's not part of what I need to do and if there's if it needed to do something else first. It wouldn't allow me to do this. Unless I have to part try to like restart. I don't think so. Maybe if I throw something at it. Ooh. I hit it. Wait. Does that look structurally different to you to you? Okay, it looks like as I'm hitting it, it's becoming more complete, but I can't even be sure if that's really the case. I'm just gonna keep throwing stuff at it. It looks like that's what's happening. It's definitely more full than it was. Oh wait, there we go. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm such an idiot. I spent all that time messing with the frequencies down there, thinking it had something to do with that, but instead, it had something to do with the, uh, the ladder, or the fan up here, which is funny because I looked at it when I was climbing up the ladder and I was like, hey, this might be a place I need to go, like in my mind while she was talking, but I'm an idiot. So there's that. There's always that. Ah, uh, why am I so dumb sometimes all the time? Sometimes all the time. I'm pretty stupid. Okay, here we go. We're going to the vents now, making some progress. Okay, well, I gotta say, this is probably a good time for me to pause it, because I honestly don't know where I'm going. It sounds scary as shit right now. I don't want to uh, be part of this, but we're going anyway, so, uh, uh-oh. Keep clear. Obviously can't do anything here. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and pause it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Like, share, favorite, and subscribe. Again, post your theories in the comment section below. I'll read my favorite one in the next episode. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.